Lap number three, let's get it underway here as we have Vitality starting on the T side and a bucket load of utility. Three, uh, two smokes, three individuals with nades and straight up mid they fake barrel. B. They fake an all in B then go long late. That's hot. But look at this mid flank. This could be... Oh, you're right. They, they didn't spot anybody up towards long. They're biting. Yeah, Disbalance has given up. They've full commit. We do need a bit of a frag here from Shoxy and well, okay then. Magix has already dealt with the long spotted the bomb. This one, nice in theory. Not so great in execution. They have got five members of Team Spirit still kicking. And now make it four. Zai, we're only going to get one with the P250. An impossible situation for RPK Ooh. to deal with. And Magix has had his cornflakes this morning. That's one way to kick things off here. They have to be riding a high after coming back from that 13-6 scoreline. We were just highlighting in the pre-game segment. And the fact that their fake would have been bang on if it was a regular CT setup was unraveled. Due to the fashion in which Spirit wanted to push up middle. That was a, a brave and brazen call and it has paid off. And here's Apex with his new signature scout. Have Deagles across the board for the remainder. Shocks. Head armor Deagles. I were looking to get the AWP up when possible. Has kept a thousand in the bank account. Does have a smoke and a flash to work with. Same as Masuta. Another smoke in the hands of RPK. Looks like as they move down middle. Could be opting for a mid to B, but Mir is playing spoiler and Chopper's up close too. He's going to pick on out, spamming away. He hasn't landed any shots just yet. He gets taken down. There were a couple of sitters. They were. They've left the bomb in tons though. Apex's job to recover does mean he'll have to brave disbalance his scout again. And he was tagged up initially through the door. So now, oh, this retrieval is going to suck. M4 equipped. Shock's low. <laughs> bomb loose. Oh, it's a dire situation to put yourself in. Misuta will have to step up here. Loud recovery. Oh. Hitting on the box. SDY could have ended the round right there and then. Just balance does take down the low HP on shocks and magics. As expected, playing towards the A site. Smoke doesn't really help him and Misuta isolated. All right, they've dealt with that. It, it did get a little bit messy. Remember what Disbalance did the other day against Fnatic? He had the scout, Flusher dropping spawn, the final yeah, kill, yeah, it was yeah. the ace. Oh, so God, yeah. I expect to see a lot of Disbalance in a map like Dust 2, especially on their CT sign, patrolling around with the scout at the moment. But at some point, it will get upgraded to the big green. He's rocking the Famous going into round number three. And, well, rocking some light upgraded pistols will be the Vitality side of things. Over towards Long is where a couple of their members will be heading. But... Just sitting passive to kick things off. One flash in the hands of Shocks. Probably going to be towards middle or for short, so they can all peer and team out. Bit of a waterfall scenario. That might be through mid doors. And that's where I just found some mirror. So they're happy to play like a two-man mid setup, and they're making it work once again. Lots of damage down. A clean one. Nice and clean compared to the previous. Spirit have to be happy with that. Holding on to three MP9s. They can play a bonus round. Silly to just throw these weapons away. There's a lot of approaches that you can go for. You can force the fight. You're on the CT side. You have a rough idea of what type of a, a buy might be coming on through. Let's see if they want to go for something aggressive. You could do a stack towards long. Really, really trying to stop teams going from that play. And actually, I just balance has purchased into the big green. So, wow. Zaiwu through the door onto Mir. Rough bit of damage to take there. And it looks like Spirit are just playing this like a standard gun round. Nothing too out of the ordinary. Magic close long with the MP9. Could be good. Just balance over there towards the A ramp. Mir being put on notice early within the round. Takes away a little bit of his potency. We have just stalled on out with a minute 20 left on the clock. Free map control being given. No jostling and jiving for territory in this stage. Now the nades will slowly flutter on through. RPK drawing two HEs and Molotov as well to keep both defenders on the B side of things. It's confirmation that there is two players in B. Might indicate that middle is less than guarded. And Chopper is going to have to fill that gap. So it does put some very stretched out CTs on notice. Thirty-eight seconds disbalance to hold them at bay. Incendiary 
Likely the perfect need to be dropping about now. Positions himself over the one way. His intentions are clear. 20 seconds, they have to go now into the nade. Softened up for the M4 as the FAMAS, the MP9. He can't seem to find a single fight. Flashed off and lots of ground covered. Masuta's gonna swing off. Goose takes his head off. Could translate into a plan, it needs to happen now and that's Zywoo. Couple of flashes for this retake. Kids are in play as well. They were on the bonus buy, right? So yeah, I'm surprised that- you Take AKs off, you, you brawl it, you fight it. It looks like they're saving. Yeah, it does. And I don't quite understand why, because you've hit the nail on the head there. The fact that this was a bonus round and they're going to save two MP9s. Like Mir and Magix would be wanting rifles so they could feel like they want to get into a fight. I understand that by holding on to these, they will be able to drop, especially Mir and AWP over to Idis Balance in the next round. But that would hopefully come with the caveat that they'll do something a little bit more aggressive and, and less default and standard because you can't fight in the same way as, as what you would with rifles. Weapons just don't have the, the value to do that. So let's see what the buy looks like. And here's our disbalance on the ramp. Molotov's everywhere. Nades are looking good. And as soon as Masuda takes that one down, well, that was literally the round. There isn't too much to report. There isn't too many highlights to show. And... Well, the MVP of the round shows that for you exactly. One kill, 100 damage in round four. <laughs> Simple as you like. And that was the case. So the AWP has been purchased across. I Balance has been gifted it. And they've all upgraded to rifles. Those MP9s that they saved, not even being used. Out past the Molotov is Zywoo, and he's actually scoped up very quickly. I'm not sure if that would have been heard by the aggressive cat play. Apex needs to be careful. Look at how many are around him. Oh, ambitious from RPK. Apex making a lot of sound keys. Chopper to hunt him down. This looks great for Spirit. Trying to rock back into favor of Vitality is shocked. He does neutralize just a little prong. But rotating to a 2-2 setup. Just balance digging in on A. SDY is going to call B apps clear. And now they have this active CT setup continuing to slowly... Line up their grip. I want to see this line up from Zaiwu. Real easy one there. On the step, back in, and that's one side of your smoke walls. Done. But they do the smoke wall and then wait. But what do they expect to be given to them? Oh, they might peek on through, but the smokes will be fading just as they get dead across. So this is all down to the timing. Here it goes. They're just fading now. They've had to get a wriggle on. Balance is in jeopardy. A high flash is his only way out. His teammates trying to fight with it. They haven't got to rush this plan. The bomb is across. That's half the hard work done. They know Disbalance was low. Flashes are desperately trying to catch him. Magic's doing well to play anti flash Getting some good headshots. Saiwoo trades. Only one. Now Shock's hitting a good one shot, but Magic's good round from all him. calm and collected. Great round from him. I, I want to really sing his praises there because you could see he was in no man's land. He was the on the time. bridge, just dodging those flashes, turning away, repick, turning away, repick. To be able to stand like that and not lose your cool and not get flustered and start spamming or over peak or try and run away. He's done a huge job here. So massive props to the youngster on the side of things from Spirit for being able to convert those kills and effectively the round. Yeah, that, that's, that really goes, is going to silence Vitality. It's going to continue to build quite a CT side. That's the texture I was talking about. Let's see what it is. Well, you weren't looking. I have to get a little bit closer. No, I was looking. I, my screen is just a little bit. Um, Angly? Yeah. It's the Telestrator screen. Ah, uh, yeah. You got a fancy one. Yeah, I have to. This this does it all. This bad boy. You can you can draw. I could draw on Shox's face when he's on screen next time. No one else oh, can see it, but uh, it, make, it would be I fun. can have fun with it. It's like the newspapers when I was a kid. All right, long control taken. Guns out. Plant was good. And he is on a mission. RPK has died there twice in a row now. Frustration. Yep. And up long they go. Disbalance. Ooh, wow, Apex was knife out that whole time. Look how fast he is into the site. And Magic, oh, he's got the one way. It's been a while since we saw that one, Chad. That's rolling back the years. I think it was G2. Poor old Zywoo. A body was on the roster. Yeah, you're right. Oh, he had a good go here. He a third. Another was around the smoke. He's patrolling. 
It's balance. He's working with three HP poor Zai. When Mir is closing the gap on long, which he will address eventually. The only way he gets a chance here is if just balance clear or Mir oh. doesn't hit that shot. Damn. Good swing. Great swing. I think last... mechanically gifted. Yeah, he is indeed. I think last time round, and this was back in season eleven, and we did hear from Apex that it was just as he had become a leader. Masuda was uh, relatively new on the roster as well, I believe. And we got the MC cam. Video games like that. It's been a while since I've played one where uh, I'm looking down the sights in that regard. I've seen some people doing the uh, doing it with their Counter Strike view model, putting oh, it right yeah. in the center. It looks like Quake. It's Guys, weird. don't do that. It's weird. Last time Spirit beat Vitality 16 to 5 on Dust 2 when they played in season 11. Gosh. Well, it was back in March. And as Apex said, his justification was that Nasuta had just joined, he'd just switched to leadership. And they are a team which no one can argue has gone on to develop and grow. You seeing the uh, Dren smoke? Oh no. A quick reaction. Alex, that was the game where Masuda went 0 and 18. That was the game. Oh, one, of, one, of his, yeah. one of his harrowing performances, but Masuta's had a great series so far. Apex is the one that's on the blue seg and Balance is having no issues. I don't know why I like Hydus Balance's name. Bang. Oof. I like the capitalization. It just seems like it's very, it's a retro gamer name. A retro gamer name. Yeah. All right. CIS have always got the uh, the good ones. Chopper, Simple, Magix. Nickelback. Nickelback. Um, Tony Black. You know, all of the iconic ones. Oh, the AK that Apex is currently working, it could be iconic if he can find a couple of openings here. 20 seconds left. There is one. That's going to take down Chopper on A, and that's changed the decision. It looked like it was going to be a mid to B split, but instead, now up cat they go. And well, to receive his magics, the aim stuff from before. Can he get more done? The oh. silence down four is looking crispy. Oh, and a chance for Apex squandered. Poor old Shox. He's just going to try and get the constellation plant, and Magix isn't letting that happen. Great round Oy. again. He's been asked to defend A against Vitality twice, and he's passed both times with a multi-kill. He's doing good, isn't he? Good work here. This was through the smoke onto Mia. <laughs> Probably feeling a little bit hard done by, by that whole situation. By the trace of fire, we can see it. Yeah, it's we, know where it, we know where it's coming from. Double orbs now. SDY picking up one eye disbalance on the primary. Good spawn for long. Should... Yeah, to pick the corner. They were not even going to be facing him earlier. It is another cap boost coming through, so Chopper might have a fight against Shox early. And I just balanced. Did find the long pick. Apex committed for that. Oh, I'm seeing evidence of tilt, Chad. Lots of these pushes up are being met. Just one fight, one on ones, no trade. For Suta, a prime example. This is all on to Zywoop. And he's running straight gray screen into SDY. Say it out loud, Chad. Say it out loud. It's your job now. That's a yikes from me, dog. Thank you. Um, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, that was literally run wherever you want on the map at the start of the round and hope you find a kill. There was no tactical nuance. You're not exaggerating, are you? No. Apex ran long and died. One yep. player ran B and died. Yep. Two players ran mid and died. Zawi ran B and died. I guess that's just when the reins do get a little too loose. Yeah, I, I understand that misdirection can be key. And if there are gamble stacks coming in on the side of things for Spirit, it, it maybe pays off. But look at that. RPK, like, what's, what, he's just running in. Yeah, well, this was the, the last frag. I mean, this is the worst example of them because I would really... Couldn't do anything couldn't else. Couldn't do anything else. But the rest of them, certainly not. Yeah, I, I'm not quite sure what Ooh, the long spawn was. for Zywu. Do you drop the scout for your boy? Uh, he's going to take the dig. It's, yeah, the... It's 2K. They're keeping it respectable. A quasi buy coming in. It needs to have some miracle frags here. They're crossing late as well to not take any damage and having three of them behind that smoke. 3B, when you know they're on a potential, you know, Tech 9's fast B, it makes sense. It to be is always a bit of a, they're a calculated. problem. They're calculating right now. Playing the percentages, and you saw what Nexa was up to whenever he had that inkling, he That's would true. adopt the exact same position as Chopper. Would it they? seems to be a many CT sides opt for this as your... It could be a B backup. You can respond to mid very helpfully as well. And let's not forget the doors have swapped around so you can really contribute from multiple new angles. And Apex keeps trying this wall bag. It's interesting. He seems to have discovered that 
You can wallbang the stone next to that closed corner in order to get the sound cue as to whether or anyone's hiding there. They might do wall smokes here to try and isolate magics towards the pit. He only has a flash, so he shouldn't get caught with his nades out. It'd be hard to see them just walk through dry here. There has to be a flash or something. I mean, my ma yeah, okay, one flash. Magix is a robot, though. He's got the perfect angle to control them. This jewel is losing track of it. He did well to find another head. That's Zaiwu dead. Shocks losing a great deal of his health to take down Mir. But he's going to try and investigate B here. You can see they've got a different plan in mind. SDY has fallen off. RPK has to sell this, but a tight angle held by Disbalance enables him to cut him down to size. He picks up short. Oh, no. Lots of it. Oh, he doesn't expect that at all. Poor old Apex. Now shocked with no help. Eight to one. Is it really going to go down like this? What a horrible way for things, considering how they lost Inferno. 13 to six up. Zywoo gets them round 15 with the AWP. Comes all the way back to overtime. They get slapped around the server. They come into dust too, and they pick up where they left off. Spirit are running away with things here. Big yawn from the clown. Oof. Facing the top right is that at all. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Double ops are back out again for Spirit, so things are looking good. Over towards Long, I just bounce again onto Apex. He's done that twice, this time blinding through a smoke. The in-game leader drops one kill to his name. This aggressive play, trying to set the tone, trying to look for info. It's not working. And now it will have to stall on out for Vitality here. They have to let Zywoo work with the orb. He might be able to find this one onto Idis Balance if he does just sneak around the corner. Matter of moments between yeah. disaster right there for either party. Oh, and there's another one. RPK didn't actually do the safe cross. Disbalance didn't see him. But so. Ooh. Oh, oh, oh. All oh. right, Chopper caught with an aid in his hands. They're gonna hit B. Or a dribble smoke at least. SDY, you're gonna play ahead of that. I love it, I love it, I love it. But he's thinking better of it. A nade instead does look primed and ready. Not quite the damage they were hoping for, nor is Mark Mir's spray. And this is the perfect gap. This is a good chance, the best in a while for Vitality. And M. Mir says no. So does Disbalance. Shocks to clutch. A good chance, but SDY plucks him from the air before he could find his accuracy once again. Oh, this is quickly getting away from them and Spirit are being very mobile. Where did the opening kill of that round come in? Two timeouts called already by Vitality. Oof. The opening kill of that round was at long onto Apex. Yes. Then where was his Idis balance? Back over towards middle, taking down Zywoo. Then he was over towards B, trying to help out. He's everywhere. He's being very mobile. And on Dust 2, you love to see that out of your AWP. If you have freedom and you have a decent set of anchors to lock down long, to babysit Cat, and your AWP can be constantly in flux, a map like Dust 2 is perfect. Out towards long, Shox is going to go. Over towards the bin, he has made it. And Magic should think better of fighting this. He will, dropping on back towards the site, but towards Cat is chop up. Oh, this is going to be problematic. Does dip on back. Oh, oh, oh. That's a nasty amount of damage. Apex has saved the day. The so flashes. RPK. The flashes have saved them. Maybe. Yes. Bomb will be planted. Disbalance considering the save. This is a, a rarity for the Team Spirit boys, but they have lost their opening jewels. And a big thank you to RPK and Apex. Keeps throwing himself into those jewels. This time, it bears fruit. And the fruit's slightly sweeter than he's ever tasted here on Dust 2. That's their second round. And his second kill. Bit of a correlation there. Oh, yeah. Has been very quiet from the Vitality side of things. They've been pushed and poked and prodded and destroyed up until this point. So I think if Spirit didn't have two orbs and they were aware of the damage that they had done to Zawu and Masuta, maybe they go for it. Maybe they have a little look in. But with how close some of the previous rounds, especially the last one on towards that B bombs I got, holding on to these is... Important, they're already nine to up. Think about this. If they just convert two more rounds out of the remaining four, they have 11. That's a huge CT half. So it's ridiculous. You, know, you don't want to let the money get out of control. And to do that, you need weapons yourself. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Oh, that was the motivational speech. Allez vous français. Oui, messieurs. <laughs> Let's go. We have grapefruit for our breakfast and play football with our friends. All right, Zywoo towards long this time. Corner smoke. Flashes will be coming out. They want to lock it down. Magix is being flashed on in. He's going to try and get towards pit. Oh, Zywoo's got a lot of space and straight into the chopper's face. He's opened it up. The Zywoo round has occurred. Vitality in pursuit of the third. Oh, an uncharacteristic miss. 
not going to make the same mistake. Oh, just balance. Show us what you got. RMPK opens things up and surely closes things down. I don't know what SDY and Mira are considering here. Not dying to shocks would be a start. And they've been able to cross that hurdle. Now it's a three on two situation. Mir's going to have a look in. He's going to see what's available. And so is SDY. Apex with another one. And this is just going to leave one man. Not in an orbit of dust two right now. We'll have to be getting out of dodge. Here's that loud RPK stomping his elephant feet towards his location. There's bullets. And that's enough for him to have a picture painted and an art. Nice, neat, and tidy frag. Continuing to try and keep those T's on the hunt and also maintain all of the goodies. The CT AK-47 is certainly a welcome change. This is how it all started. Zaiwu, half of this, and it's hard to appreciate, I understand, with the, with the, you know, the fact that we get the transparent screen. It would be a lot of fun if we kept showing you fully flash screens, but like Zaiwu, <laughs> Zaiwu was just full blind navigating to that fight. As his vision restored, so was Choppers, and they kissed in the smoke. Zaiwu pulled the trigger first. But like that, navigating in a flashbang is, is, is part and parcel of the skill set that these players are equipped with that many uh, struggle to appreciate. And it's, it's hard to appreciate when the, what you're looking at isn't quite the same, which is why I'm loving uh, all of the times we're pulling out those uh, X-ray toggles, helps everyone kind of uh, remind themselves. Appreciate yeah. the game of Counter-Strike. Like, yeah, you know, the same reason you're shouting at Messi because he could have just walked it in the net. Same reason all of those children get upset after spending their parents' money when they shouldn't. Reality is these are human beings and at the top of their game, but volatile in the same way every... Single one of us is. Still not out of the running for vitality, but this mental game has to be won as well. 9-6 is not a terrible half. 9-6 is very serviceable. So it was looking deadly, it was looking dangerous, it was looking out of reach, but now, as the tide can change with this round win for vitality, they can very easily sew up a 9-6 and bring their confidence back with it. Sew up, that's exactly what they'd be doing. Yeah, like the teddy bear has lost an arm already. The eyes falling off. Oh, for sure. It's been in the washing machine. It really shouldn't have. Jumping up for the info. Confirms that they were actively holding short and potential for a boost onto that AWPer over the smoke. It looks like a conversation they were having. Just balance things otherwise. <laughs> Jumping for info when you know there's an AWP short. That's brave. And a smoke exchange. They have access to long. Clearing the car at this point. Apex is trying to make it look like there's more than one. Is he really going to join them? No, he's going to have other plans. So they're just going to stall out this long cross with smokes. Magic still has a smoke to dip on down on the site, a Molotov to put on the ramp to displace the fights. You can see them lining up their utility now. Mir is also in CT spawn, can also drop a Molotov to delay the plant. Here it comes. So this utility, as soon as we hear it landing, Magic drops. Molly to follow. HE as well. Good chunk of damage. That is glorious. And now look at this. They're just coming through. Their toes visible. Balance has done well to keep this competitive in favor. And now Mir pushes through. Masuta caught as well. Bombs loose. Apex, they know there was a present short. He is going to be found out by SDY. And 10. Chad, 10 rounds on CT side. Third map. Looks like Spirit are getting the better of Vitality again. And let's not forget the last time these two faced off. 16-5. 16-5 and a best of three victory for Spirit across the three maps. It was actually Inferno, Dust2 and Overpass. You want it to get worse for a second? Yeah, go on. They managed 11 T-sided rounds last time. Oh. Oh. My. And that's the CT side with 10 already. So definitely a map they're no slouch upon. Vitality, bit of a wake-up call here. Oh, he's pushing through. Chopper, you madman. Yeah, he likes to catch the my surprise, and it's going to be Masuta, the potential victim. Flashes. Oh, oh no. so good. Oh, so well played. They got Mir putting bullets down middle in the smoke as it fades for another. Spirit of the better team right now, and it's, it's impossible to argue that. The mid-aggression, perfectly, completely pulling the rug from underneath the setup. RPK doing well to find just one, but that's 11. Team Spirit coming into Dust 2 and fully equipped, prepared, and ready, willing and able. Great stuff here from Spirit, and... They are looking great to grab 12. 12. Oh, that says it all. How do you call yourself out of this hole? 
Scout for Zywoo. AKs across the board. Utility wants more. Vitality need this. The French, they have to get themselves back in the game. And a tag, well, that's a good place to start. Apex out towards Long. He's going to finally find some success. Yeah, a great deal of health lost, but that's Magic's court too, and he's such a phenomenal A defender now. Removed. Final round. It's necessary. Disbalance reactions in the more. Ooh, free peeking is dangerous, but Molotov's coming. What's his options here? It's nothing other than survival. Crouching, looking for something. A wild speculative shot. Smokes and bullets finally find him. Whew. Lots of casualties now for Team Spirit. It should just be Vitality wrapping this one up and putting a bow on it. They're all just staying long right now. Postured watching the flank is shocks. Looking for anything he can find is Zywoo, but they're happy to take the fight. They're happy to take the jewels, and Masuda is too. Zywoo finishes him off with that sal salvaged M4, and that's going to be the half. 11 to 4. Vitality bounced back in the last round, but they need a lot more. We could learn how to love from mistakes Straight from the jump and away for an answer Wish we could smile when shit's rough nowadays Change our reflections Feelings don't die around this neighborhood. We used to sell a double pills, young and misunderstood. My homie, tell me what is changing from your point of view. A smaller circle, but the range is for some deja vu. I recognize my future, and there is nothing with you. Unless you turn your photo around, success might come recruit you. But unless you analyze in depth, that we're steps away from death. A thousand possibilities act on it, Johnny Depp. For real. Cause we're lonesome towns, trying to know what part of brought us down in here. I don't wanna be stuck in countless towns. I just wanna smile and run away from you. I swear to God, man, I just wanna be a model for my brother. Hey, I just gotta work until I'm on the covers. Hey, hey, I just gotta work until my songs are covered. Hey, hey, I just wanna make it proud to be my mother. Wish we could learn how to love from mistakes. Straight from the jump and away for an answer. Wish we could smile when she's rough nowadays. Spirit are just five rounds away from causing quite the uproar in French Counter-Strike. Team Vitality pipped, and many 
have them down as one of the top three teams in competition at the moment. We saw what they were capable of, of course, over at ESL 1 Cologne. And now, well, starting their journey in the groups of the Ram Robin ESL Pro League 12th season. And Team Spirit are here to cause an upset. You can see the recap in the top right of your screen. Inferno was nearly Vitalities. 13 to 6 was where they started to let that one slip away. And now at 11 to 4, it feels like the same may be happening here on D2. Fill us in, Chad. Where are we at in this pistol? Oh, this one's a much slower approach than what we saw from Spirit. They were barreling up mid within the early stages of a team vitality fake. But this time round, it's sit back, wait for the pushes yourself, hold on to your utility because Chopper and I Disbalance have some smokes and flashes to use. Now, they push back long. And this would tell you that there must be a cat or mid setup in play. The fact that you didn't see anybody towards the corner or the car position allows SDY to give that information across. And still fighting middle, I just bounce wants to make sure that they're unable to continue to attack. But it is going to be the B finish. The problem with this right now is the rotation from Apex will be quick. He has flashes to constantly lo lob above the head of Masuta. So Masuta has a real chance to lock this one down. All eyes on the youngster. Ah, disbalance using his P250 like a sniper. And the smoke arrives just as Apex does. He's going to have to up the window. There's five eyes on it. The flank is in. And Zaiwu, he's struggling to make the first conversion. Does onto SDY. He can smoke off tunnels here. And he has two USPs rattling through the smoke. That's a lot of info. Bomb down. RPK and Apex coming in from the main side. Looks like the tunnels players are actually rotating in to group up. And oh, that duel is everything. Chopper's gone down, Mir to be the hero. It looks like this retake can work. Jumping to draw the fire. Disbalance can't do it, overwhelmed. And a little overworked. Great job, Zaiwu with the double. RPK the same. And it felt like Team Spirit had the right approach in terms of getting into the site, getting that bomb down. They did manage to achieve all of their goals there. It was just the coordinated shots and retake coming in from that French squad. So this is the opener. What a great start. I feel like Masuda didn't even have a chance to react. No. Nope. Like he had no idea it was Calvin. Oh, well, I dead. reckon it was probably as the nade comes in, you know, for a second his eyes go, oh, okay. and then bonk before he can even press his crouch key. Oh dear. That's a rough one to lose considering what that yeah. would have meant for Team Spirit. Oh here. look, SDY's got the light thing thingy-majiggy on his... Okay. Light thing image. It's gonna take way too long to explain. All right, I'll you come back in the to car. You. Yeah. Give me a diagram or something. Yeah, yeah, you yeah, yeah, tell yeah, yeah. It. You can make it so that the bomb flashes are much more visible. So he had like a big flashing red light on his screen. I think that's from his keyboard or his peripherals. Oh. So he can track the bomb flashes even when he's not looking at them. It's interesting. Yeah. I could be making that up, but it was a random red flash in the center of his screen that made no sense otherwise. But that's me making assumptions. And as my father taught me, you shouldn't do those assumptions if you make assume makes you look like a bit of an ass. Long story short. Okay, well this force buy from Spirit, pretty potent really. Galil's, AK, Mac 10, mm. Good and movement. pushing Apex back. That's the kind of movement everyone should aspire for. Really enables you to play a different brand of Counter-Strike. Take that space, you're a real threat as you can sweep and fill that gap as they force the jiggle off. Misuta hunted by SDY. You could see how well positioned SDY was to not struggle in the left eye. A flash is he pushing? He is with a scout on his back. He's tucked himself into the potential threat corner and now pushing. Mir can't believe his luck. Is there anyone else? Yes, there is. And Mir will take them both. Shocks. Bombs delivered to his front door. Oh, he nearly no. had them all lined up. But that's the end of that one. Oh no, this is actually worse than Vitality losing the pistol. Losing the second round force. And then now only having a $1,400 loss bonus. Oh, they've got peanuts, Chadney. Oh, no. Not even peanuts. Oh, that's quite a nice legume. So here's the deal. If this was the first half, it wouldn't be as much of a problem because they have 15 rounds or, well, they would have now 13 rounds to work themselves back into the game. But with 1,400 left, here are your options. Eco, only get 1,900, and then still have to take a save going into the next. Force by now, which they have gone for. Lose this. Have to take an eco next. <laughs> you know what I'm That's 14. Contact. Look at this. This is going to be super quick. Apex, good damage, but Chopper very quick on the trigger. And poor Masuta will need to find more than one. He's still just getting his vision back as Mir blows his head off. Shocks the challenge. He's got incendiary trying to force him into the fights. He will have to just back away. And now, Chad, you've, you've painted a perfect picture here. And the way the Spirit have approached this, it, 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 it's, there's no win. You either save Deagles and Kevlar. It's not even Deagles and Kevlar. It's a P250. 
Unarmored Deagles, they're on the goose egg. By the time they have real weapons, by the time they actually get to play their CT side, this this game could be over. Indeed. So the question becomes, do they want to force by next round and just go all in? Oh, right? I hate but, it. So the, the choice is, and the most logical option at this point is just to save next round and not go for the buy. Okay. But things are really, really desperate that I could see a world where the tilt comes through yeah. and they do just go for, well, screw it. We're screwed anyway. We're going to have nothing. Let's just force. Let's just go all in. So we kills everyone and we play on and it's 13-13. Well, that's what they need. And that's that's the ticket out here is, is you don't, you're not going into a force by round expecting everybody to go to the positions, hold them and get a kill each. You're expecting... Here we go. This was... I wanted to see how this fight shaped up because he gets three kills in this round. Of course, Mir, once again, being a, a large contribution. I was actually visualizing that hold into CT, which put them in that dire straight in the force buy in the first place. But round 19 and already taking a quick look at the scores, you can see that Mir and Disbalance, you said they were statistic leaders and doing so again in this series. Good reason for that now is that eco I was talking about has come on through. Conceding 14 and then Margin Ferreira being almost entirely nullified. A great hey, flash. Can... Are they trying to give Masuda flashbacks? be any issues. CY's confirmed it. Magic's containing and con making converting a very quick round in the end there. Gets himself a free pistol upgrade delivered to him by the Vitality Squad. An org out for Apex, seeing Sai will want his signature AWP. Good to see that SDY's got himself a nice jug of hydrogen oxygen. This is just bleak. It's very difficult for me to see the hype train here for Vitality. I just think Vitality, uh, sorry, Spirit have done so much work that they can convert this with ease. This is the gun round. This is the attempt. This is the chance to not let them get to 15. And they don't even have a defuse kit, Alex. They don't even have a defuse kit. Kit watch going absolutely mad on their forums. I highlighted the execute from Spirit uh, in the pre-show using refrag. If they get cat control, that could be something we go for here. And Apex is looking to pl play spoiler with the Org. Well, guess whose party's spoiled right now? Mir takes him down, even goes forward to drop a smoke. They're not giving up short control. They've actually taken long. And this way of flushing out the rotation and forcing them to dip down and have to deal with whatever could be going on out those doors. Well, there's nothing and Mir has another opportunity. Watch this. You wouldn't. As it fades, he's going to try and find RPK. Around the edge of the smoke, but RPK too wise to his games. He'll grab himself the AK, and now we do have a very viable defense. They don't have any util, not even a flashbang for a Zaiwu Warp Peak down long. This will have to be a very peculiar setup. Or passive in nature. Zaiwu's all the way at B, so RPK and Shocks. Former, tagged down to 46. Is Shocks just going to pivot here? Oh, Happy Cat has no one's cross. He's not even looking. What's going on here? One for one. They will have access to the site, but of course, CT push is a real problem and the boost. Oh, oh it's going to be perfect. They can't fight. Yeah. It's a safe plan. You bang on. And they don't want to linger there too long. Magic's unknown. This is for 15 against Vitality. Masuta does not go down despite heavy damage inflicted. He's still operating at 3 HP. SDY needs a multi kill. He boost. That's what he was waiting for. Levels the odds. Zaiwu reveals the AWP is there too. And Disbalance can clean things up. Masuta's gone as well. 15 to 5, folks. I can't quite believe it. Team Spirit have come into Dust 2. Look at the money. Vitality have been counting their pennies, looking behind sofa cushions, shouting at their friends for that lunch, that milk they bought them last week. Oh. I don't know why I'm going for like a high school analogy, but safer that way. Deary me, deary, deary me. Score last time 16-5. Score this time looking very likely to be 16-5. Not a rerun, I promise. Now, when we play this game on a rerun, they're going to be like, liar, oh. liar. Yes, sorry. Everybody. Liar, it is a rerun. watching this in the future. Hello, future people. How's the how's the world doing? Today is currently the Sunday, the sixth of September. It is uh, five twenty-seven p.m. here in Cologne, Germany. Uh, we are bringing oh, it's like you a little time capsule. Action. So maybe note what's going on in your time on your day. See how the world's changed. Yeah, look around you. Mindfulness. Take a deep breath. Think of like four things you can hear around you. My voice being one of them. Probably if you've got headphones on, that's about it. If you haven't got headphones on, you probably can hear lots of things. A lots of things. Maybe a lawnmower. Other human beings living their life parallel to yours and yet never interacting or intersecting. Bang. 
Oh. Legs up, Shoxy. Okay. Oh, it's long. Here we go. Apex is so dead. Oh, he, he almost big. had a double there. So maybe, hold up a second. Vitality, with all this early damage, two low players of SDY and Chopper, there is a world, and we might even start living in it. Lots of utility left. Mia out there again. Solo mission. Up to the moon. Out mid doors. Nor the RuneScape YouTuber. Apex might have to be a bit of a hardcore Iron Man if he wants to hold off this long push. And his death will be permanent. This is potentially the final round of play. Disbalance does catch another. He's done so much damage already. Look at SDY oh. Chopper. Damn, Apex. That's exactly what they needed to start things off. Mir, the only real threat. And it comes down to his decision making as well as that of the CTs. He has been set up there for so long that there's an, here. Yeah, there's an element of surprise now. But Masut is checking it. Oh, oh. Mir's hitting his shot. He even spotted RPK. He's going to try and get them moving. I like this. Oh, that's ambitious. Yeah, RPK's going to get hunted. Oh, the spray is a bit of a sketchy one. Magix catches it. Let's panic now. And another time. Another one. He's doing it all. This is essentially all Apex, baby. Two now remain, and they're tagged up. Chopper, though, he uh -oh. seems to be even better when he's got low HP. SDY didn't get spotted out. Apex can win this and should win this if... Chopper does misstep. 20 seconds. He has to mantle eventually. Oh, God, another fantastic shot. Leader leading by example. Shock's on long as well. SDY's got to be concerned of that time. Patience from Shock. Time and death. Oh, wow. Okay, there was moments of that round getting very, very dicey, but Vitality now post six, saving two scouts. That's all they are taking forward. Two scouts from a one round against orbs and rifles. You've gone to the bargain basement bins and you've come home with nothing. And that could have been the moment right there. Not to be. Spirit will have another swing, another crack. Disbalance the AWP out. The AKs cross the board. Famous is on the other side. Scout M4s. The buy is clearly leaning in the favor of Team Spirit who just need five more kills, one more round to upset Vitality here today in a three-map banger. Inferno, if you missed it, that was quite the comeback. Quite the resilient showing. They've been hitting more B as well here on Dust too. Like, I mean, you mentioned Inferno, but clearly Spirit know that there is going to be a little more discomfort when you're hitting the less popular site against Vitality. This might be the execute we were prefacing earlier. The one that we showed with the Molotovs towards Goose. It'll be the three smokes. You'll have the one limping out on top of the bridge, one landing on the elevator boxes, and the third deep towards CT spawn. It'll be flashes to allow Chopper to jump down and force forward, and his main duel will be Zywoo. Oh, it's a variation. They're doing something different. It's a mid to B. They've drawn them in. Oh, I reckon Zai was going to peek on this flashbang. He's feeling spicy. Little throwback to the snacks of yesteryear through the smoke. And it is almost a wonderland. Mir, though, still does find something away in. Shots catching them unawares, and that's the end of the round. Not sure why they hadn't considered it. It must have just been SDY's position. Mir assumed it had been swept and, cle and cleared. Well handled, though. Yeah. It was all Zaiwu. The fact that he can disrupt that mid to B. Obviously, Shocks needing to clean things out. Mop it up. Two on the trot now, and that one was a little bit cleaner than the previous. So if they continue to go in this direction of having round after round of getting easier and easier, then Vitality, they maybe can mount a comeback of their own. Let's see if they've got the, it in them just the same as the CIS squad. It's a Hero AK in the hands of SDY. Some upgraded pistols. Chopper and Mir will just be keeping the Glocks, and Masuda is trying to Force into lower dark to see what information he can find. Not only that, Apex aggressive middle. Zywo aggressive catwalk. And this was all searching while the long tunnels were given up. So I just balance the magics have smokes. Once they get pit control, they can go for the same old rinse and repeat. And RPK does not have the best weapon in the world to be receiving the AK of SDY. Good nade. Bonk. That's the perfect target. The only threat on that AK-47, and there's more where that came from as well. SDY catches nades and bullets down to four before he even gets to pull the trigger. 
well handled. It's another clean round. So it went from real, real sketchy to uh, a little bit. We're in a nicer neighborhood to ah, white picket fence, dog, big house. Yeah, I mean, yes, Chad, but there is a leaky pipe that they were warned about when they moved in. And they live on a cliff. And they live on a cliff. And it's windy on the weather forecast for the next, uh, what's... Seven rounds. Seven days. Seven days. Yeah. Okay. Well, that, that doesn't sound ideal. It doesn't sound ideal. Because uh, that leaky it? pipe on the foundation of the mountain, it could slowly slide off into the Precisely. water. It's concerning. A strong breeze as well. I don't like that. So it's, it's not tickety-boo. It's not perfection. Scout and an AWP. Just spotting for the lower dark cross there was Ida Spal. It's not getting anything delivered his way. If they do go late long, there are still two players pushed actually quite forward. Zaiwu and RPK locking down that position right now. SDY dropping the door, smoke, baiting out some utility here, trying to jostle and do whatever damage he can. His apex. But look at the territory Masuda and Shocks have taken up towards the upper tunnels. It's full control, full information. RPK does have to do a lot here, though. Reveals his location, drops a smoke of his own design, Zaiwu to support. That's magic. The first one's ratting in the smoke. I was caught him. Mir did find Apex, but the flurry of frags does go Vitality's way once Bombs again. Down. Bomb down round, surely there's. SDY in disbalance, though. The AWP to fight back into long. I don't really... RPK doesn't strike me as the kind of player that would give that fight willingly. And he does. Okay. He signed the consent form today. And Shocks, on the other hand, I think he has a different plan in... They have to cross long. They have to try and get to the bomb. So he's going to peek before they even get moving. Shock's taking down the AWPer. And now the chase is on. SDY, 35 seconds. Has to convert this kill. Has a gauntlet to run and can't get past the first hurdle. So nine on the board for Vitality now. Round after round, they mount. Taste their own medicine, perhaps. Let's not forget how close Vitality were to closing out Inferno. Now it's the French's turn to show us what they got. Do you know what helps the medicine go down, Alex? A spoon full of sugar? Well, I wouldn't mind seeing some sugar from Spirit here because if they go into a bit of a half-buy scenario, get themselves some techers that wreckers, some utility as well, and go for a B-execute, which is exactly where they're heading, they could overcome Masuta, who is only on nine kills. Shox is there too, but all it's going to take is some equal trades. I mean, yeah, Masuta's at doors, so... Oh, he's well out of dodge. Shocks, this could be massive. The timing on this could be insane. Didn't even see the nades flying and he'll hear the smoke and flash to slow. Rotate coming in, two of them. Zai was very quick and what a shot. They can't overwhelm. The CTs have arrived just when they needed to. Okay, 10. Now we can start looking at the serious angle for this comeback. We wait for the double digits, then we sit up straight. And so does Team Spirit, because how many of these can they squander? It's always the hardest round, chat. Uh, that goes without saying. Oh, just such conviction behind his aim. It's that one-to-one -one relationship with his hand and his mouse. Double orb shock has a big green as well this time round. Well, that's quite the change up. They are going long. Big kill. That's a huge start. Vitality starting off by removing one of the highest fraggers. Chopper's hiding in the smoke on blue bin. But they want to take long. They want to deny it. They want to kill them all. And Magic is trying to stand up to the ground. He doesn't quite manage to get enough. RPK still standing vigilant over on the tunnels. A flash for his fight. Mir's not checked. Masuta does find him. Vitality are on track for a comeback. Oh. RPK gets them both off the back of that flash. I just need to double check our round timeline here to see how competitive these rounds have been in the last few. Good point. In the last six rounds that have been posted on the board for Vitality, there's been a total of nine kills. So things have really slowed. In the last three, there's only been a total of four kills. Not a lot of damage being done right now. And Vitality do have to buy round after round. And if they continue to win with one or two players alive and where their bank is right now, they should be sitting pretty to complete this comeback. But all it takes is one. And Spirit will take their second last time out, talking through what options they could have to finishing this one off. Long, well, when Vitality have all the troops there, it looks pretty difficult to take. Wonder if they can get cat control and go for that execute. 
See if that can be a... Surprised they haven't seen it once or twice, because it was such a big part of their uh, initial game plan. First time we saw them on Dust 2. Good nade. Here they come towards RPK's domain. He's got his plans. I have been here before. Oh, okay. Well, I was got one, I guess. Some die young eventually. Does knock the tank down of the pit. Oh no. Now he's in trouble. Oh. No, he's not. Saved by the fell. Saved by the Apex Predator. They have an AK, they have a scout. It seems unlikely unless there's over peaks coming in from Vitality. They don't need to fight this. The bomb going through T-Spawn right now in SDY. Is he going to duck? He is. So Shox will not see this. He's made his way through. B is open, but with the doors the way that they are, Shox can very quickly flick from his current position, his current angle, and maybe catch SDY trying to get onto that B bomb site. Noise from either balance can be made towards long, but it looks like he's thinking better of it. This is the rotation from Shox. So he can stay in two positions at once here. Obviously, there will be a blind spot. It all comes down to timing. Shocks with the smoke has just closed that blind spot up. Apex has taken away any other opportunity for misdirection. Oh, do you walk through it? You, you just, you, 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 oh. you may as well, considering the circumstances, but. Ah, that's a nasty one for him. He, just so much hard work. There's so much silence. Now there's nades. Shocks can just stay at B. They're confirming nothing's A. He's in limbo and. Well, just be a fine time to Apex too. Whew. Quick end. Triple kill from Apex in that one. Certainly starting to wake up. You saw his contributions with that scout. Like, mm. this CT side is where Apex has started to make the contributions necessary. That's just... Um, silly, that's what that silly. is. Yeah, that's just silly. <laughs> oh, dear. You just swing the mouse. Quick scope. I get a kill. Yeah, easy as that. Mate, I struggle to get a kill when they're not even looking at me. Yeah, he saw him for less than a second uh, before that smoke bloomed. And the flashes arrived on the cross. Okay. Oh, no. Not, Not like, like this. this. Oh, dear. Jinx. The Dust 2 double doors. Quite the polarizing conversation topic. We saw what happened in the Complexity Astralis game. We saw how uh, the players feel about those doors and how at moments like this, after such a monumental comeback, seven rounds in a row from Vitality, it could all be taken away from them because he had to go and defend B. Oh, I'm really, really quite worried for Vitality here. 4v5, long control is really all that they have. Ways to equalize with I Disbalance being the overseer from top middle seem few and far between. Zywu, your star player, will be stuck in one position. He can't rotate around. He's not in a place where he can flex on the map and find you some impact. So it will come down to shocks if they do decide to go towards that A side of things. Dropping his smoke. Now they're throwing out some mid to be nades. This could be a problem. Apex is here. That was the dink. Four on four. Flash, Cyber to be tested here. And he does miss He's his missed. first shot. Yeah, this is gonna get problematic now because they can spread all of that time. Still does well onto disbalance. Players to his right, but he just ignores them. And that was what he was waiting for. He knew he could try and find a second. It's three on three. Three frags from Spirit causing the upset. Some die young losing out on his duel because RPK is on the warpath. 18 seconds. That bomb needs to go down. It's the responsibility of Mir. Apex is low. Very low. Spotted as well. Finished off by Magics. That comes from tunnels. And a great shot. RPK is doing all the hard work. He's got smoke. He's got monotons. Oh. And Shocks just shot the head off of him. Oh. And we live to fight another day. Good grief, a miss from Zywa. Bomb plant space. I thought they had enough, but it's RPK winning his angel onto SDY. He was ready and raring to go. We go again, folks. They conceded this opening death. Vitality gonna be feeling so good to be able to convert that back. And you can see what Zywa's intentions were. It was RPK though. That was the duel that saved him. Lucky shocks overseeing there and not fluffing with their nades, getting caught out of position. Big round to win and the comeback. Well, if you didn't believe in it before, you better start believing now. Two more rounds is all they need to take us to overtime in two consecutive maps. And I just found the AWP again. This time won't be finding an opening kill. Towards long we barrel. Now as he goes, Apex in the pit, RPK on the corner. It's a world where it goes one for one and that's the one we live in. Oh, Magix, I think he's been spotted out. He's managed to get back into the 
Long doors. So much utility dumped on just that one area of the map to deal with that long take. And the 4v4, it hasn't left a major gap. They don't have enough smokes here on Cat to actually do an execute. They need I Dispans to hit a shot here, Alex. Yeah. He's gone wide for it. So I was doing very well to at least stay alive. Swinging into the site, though, he's lost a lot of ground. He'll throw the flash over to Peek. And Magix is coming. Ball. Yeah, Masut has got one. Magic's all alone, and they are already on the defuse. He'd have to stop him now. Avoids the flash, can't take the shot, and that will be 15 to 14. Wow. Max lost bonus, of course, at this point, but they will have one more bite of the cherry before we reset. We scrap all of that, and an incredible comeback from the French here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine rounds in a row. Jeez. Suits are instrumental in that flank right there. If they were able to establish post plant positions, it could have looked very, very different. It's B spawns right now for Spirit. They're not going to take them completely. The bomb actually on Magic's back going towards long, three towards upper tunnels. I just bounced down to a scout as opposed to an AWP. This could be the round where that execute comes in. This could be the time to make it sing. There's no harassment in middle. Altov from Mir forcing back the closed doors. Off shot as a warning from Zaiwu. This is my domain. I'm here. I'm ready. And he might even have a kill. There it is. Zaiwu opens up the account. All the more difficult now. Operating at a disadvantage. They start to gather rather fast, actually, towards short. And Chopper, if he can just keep making this space, that's a great find. Zaiwu, though, he's gone too. Surely not the 16-14. RPK added to the list. It's only the B players. Shocks. And Ms. Suta up against the world. Utility, kits, weapons. But from nine consecutive rounds, Spirit have got the best shot they've had in some time. And advancing back into the fray with a reluctant tut on his tongue is Shocks. Yeah, finding Ms. Suta, that's almost confirmed. He's going to tell him where he is. Running out of chances, Team Spirit 16. They've done it. The upset after such a magnificent attempt at the comeback. It's the A hit to 